Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you, a quick love reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this, Cancer. All right, so um, thank you, Lord God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. All right, um, Cancer, how you're coming to the reading is the Three of Swords, heartbroken, maybe even tears. You cried tears over a certain situation. I don't know, it could have been that there was a third party, there is a third party, there were words spoken, or there's a breakdown in communication. It could have been a breakdown in communication there because someone found out about another party, another issue, another person, something that someone did and or said. Um, yeah, someone cried over this. They're just absolutely heartbroken about this. There's alienation and isolation. Maybe you could be isolating yourself from this person. Uh, this person could be alienating you or isolating you, you know. Um, there could have been a third party stirring up trouble or is stirring up trouble within a connection. how your person's coming to the reading the knight of pentacles okay so they're being very stubborn persistent um pragmatic dogmatic they're not giving up they're just stuck they're like a bulldog in terms of what it is they want with you or from you um you definitely could be dealing with someone from your past your recent past here your person is um right now not doing much being kind of unmovable but they see you as something that they want to go after or be with or be with you for a very long time um they see you as they see the situation as needed to put in more hard work and effort and persistence to see it through they also see maybe like an angel guiding you two back together it's going to bless this union bless this connection that's what your person is viewing this connection as like you know if i just stay the angel of persistence here in terms of you know if i stay that if i stay the course then i'll get what i want uh from this person or i'll get them to change their mind the advice here is the nine of swords um deal with whatever hurt this is the nine of swords talks about trying to skirt away from the pain um but you're going to have to rest in that sea of emotions and thoughts and really process how you feel. Go through it. Grieve. Grieve the hurt, the injustice, the pain. It looks like you guys are separated here. Uh, go through the emotions. Say what you need to say. Let it out. Scream. Cry. Throw something. Talk to a friend. Talk to a psychic. Talk to, I don't want to say psychic. Talk to, talk to a counselor. Talk to somebody about what is going on with you. You can't keep it bottled up or bottled in. You you may be going over in a loop, a situation, an event, a conversation, and it just drives you nuts. It drives you mad. You may not even be able to sleep well at night. You're not getting a lot of sleep. You could be suffering from some insomnia. You could work at night. You could be a night shift worker. There's something where your sleep is disrupted. Um, yeah, your sleep patterns are disrupted here for whatever reason, but you need to deal with this, you know, even if you need to get outside help. And that's the advice here. The outcome to this connection is the page of swords. So it looks like you eventually will communicate. It looks like you're trying to, the page of swords talks about um, choosing your battles wisely and um, trying to avoid petty argument, gossip, slander um something just blowing up and misunderstandings um maybe in your pursuit or their pursuit of you when you guys do talk it will be more so of a discovery process just trying to gain information knowledge about what happened where you went wrong how you can fix it um the outcome also is somebody getting information on you 
maybe even going to tarot card readers. They could be a tarot card reader. Looking at social media, there's an element of spying or prying into your life. Um, it looks like somebody's really going to try to show up their gentleman like or lady like and sweep you off your feet and put you in a place where uh, you can fall in love with them again. This is what the energy is, um, you know, this is what they want. This is what they're trying to move towards. Could be dealing with the Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini and Libra highlighted. Um, Aquarius also and uh, Virgo Capricorn okay Gemini again um, so this is what I have for you guys I hope that it resonates if it does go over to the website book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below paying for your question receiving the answer to your question on your mobile device you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link all right thank you guys many blessings to you